Hello friends, so here we are with another question on Zener diode circuits. So it is a very simple and straightforward one. It has been asked in this circuit, okay, to find out this output voltage across this 5 kilo ohm resistance when the Zener diode with breakdown voltage of 6 volt it is working properly when it is short circuited when it is open circuit okay so first let us understand the circuit here we have the Zener diode with its N end connected to the positive 12 volt and negative end connected to ground when the Zener diode is working properly what it means is that it is an on state so in that case the circuit will look something like this six volt five kilo ohm. When the Zener voltage is activated or on, it acts as a constant voltage source. So it will be replaced by a constant voltage source which is 6 volt. And this output voltage appearing will be equal to 6 volt. Okay, it will be equal to 6 volt. When it is short circuited, it means that we will replace this whole circuit in the second case we will replace it with a short circuit here it means that the output voltage is equal to 0 volt then when it is open circuited then in that case we have to determine this current flowing okay so here it will be the current flowing is equal to 12 by 1 plus 5 kilo ohm which is equal to how much 2 milliampere volt by kilo ohm 2 milliampere and the output voltage is this current multiplied with this resistor 5 kilo ohm that is 2 milliampere into 5 kilo ohm which is equal to 10 volt so in that, this case when it is open circuited the output voltage is equal to 10 volt ok so these are the behavior of this circuit in these three cases first when it is working properly it is replaced by its breakdown voltage a constant voltage source 6 volt output voltage is 6 volt when it is short circuited the output voltage is 0 volt and when it is open circuited we have to find out the current flowing through the circuit from this voltage source to ground and then output voltage is the voltage drop across this 5 kilo ohm resistor which is 10 volt okay so this is another question on um, Zener diode circuits so here we have this circuit where we have two Zener diodes which are rated at 15 volt 200 milliamperes they are connected in this mode okay back to back and here we have to find out the regulated output voltage and the value of this series resistance okay
these two values we have to find out. Now, these two values, the rating 15 volt and 200 milliampere, they are very important. So, it means the equivalent circuit, both of them will undergo breakdown and will behave as constant voltage sources of value 15 volt. So, the equivalent circuit will be something like this. Fifteen volt, fifteen volt, VZ one, VZ two. This is R. So the output voltage is simply fifteen volt plus fifteen volt, which is equal to thirty volt, VZ one plus Vz2. Okay. And the current rating for both the diodes is the same. It means 200 milliampere will flow through both the diodes. So, this is 45 volt. So, in order to find out the value of R, if we apply KVL in this direction, it will be 45 minus 200 into R. Make sure it is in milliampere minus 30 equals to 0. That implies R is equal to 45 minus 30 volt by 200 milliampere. Always pay attention to the units because if you make mistake in the units, the answer will be wrong. So, R is equal to 15 volt by 200 milliampere so it is 75 ohm. I converted into ampere so, 200 into 10 to the power minus 3 ampere, 10 to the power minus 3, it means it went to the numerator and we have the result. So, the value of R is equal to 75 ohm. Okay. So, this is a question related to Zener diodes connected back to back. Both of them will undergo breakdown because 45 volt is much greater than the breakdown voltage 15 volt, the rated breakdown voltage. So, that was important in order to find out the regulated output voltage and the rated Zener current was important in the calculation along with this 15 volt Zener voltage was uh, required to calculate the value of the series resistance R. Okay? So, this is another question uh, related to Zener diode circuits. Again, Zener diodes connected back to back. So, here three Zener diodes Z1, Z2 and Z3 they are connected back to back. Okay? And we have the input voltage uh, 45 volt uh, the input unregulated voltage and uh, these three Zener diodes are connected along with the series resistance to get a regulated output voltage. So, again the Zener diodes are rated at 10 volt Zener breakdown voltage and Zener current 1000 milliampere. We have to find out the regulated output voltage and series resistance R. Now, if you see the input unregulated voltage is greater than the rating, the voltage rating breakdown voltage 10 volt. So, all these three Zener diodes will undergo breakdown and behave as constant voltage sources of 10 volt. Okay? So, it will be something like this. Okay? It is 10 volt, 10 volt, 
10 volt vz1 vz2 3 this is r it's 45 volt okay so the output here the regulated voltage that is equal to vz1 plus vz2 plus vz3 which is equal to 30 volt then in order to find out the series resistance r the rating uh, the current rating which is 1000 milliampere so the value of r is simply the input unregulated voltage minus the output regulated voltage divided by the Zener current specified by the rating which is 1000 milliampere it is equal to 15 volt by 1000 milliampere which is 15 volt by 1 ampere equal to 15 ohm okay the value of r is equal to 15 ohm and the output regulated voltage is 30 volt okay so again this is a question related to zener diode circuits diodes zener diodes connected back to back okay and this is the solution